Hello everyone. Today, we're going to learn about some amazing creatures that live in our world. But, did you know that animals come into main categories? They vertebrates and invertebrates. Let's explore the differences between these two groups. Vertebrates are animals that have a backbone, just like you and me. This backbone, also called a spine or vertebral column, is made up of a series of bones called vertebrae. It gives vertebrates the ability to stand upright and provide support for their bodies. Vertebrates are a diverse group of animals that includes mammals, birds, reptiles, amphibians, and fish, each with its unique characteristics and features. Mammals Mammals are the most well-known group, including animals like cats, dogs, humans, and others. They are warm-blooded and often have fur or hair. Mammals can be found all over the world and come in various shapes and sizes. Let's explore more examples. Elephant Camel Zebra Birds Birds are known for their feathers and ability to fly. We have colorful parrots, wise owls, and majestic eagles. They're the only animals that can truly soar through the skies. Let's look at other examples of birds. Seagull Rooster Toucan Reptiles Reptiles are cool animals with scaly skin. They come in different shapes and sizes, from lizards to turtles, some of them slither, and some have legs. Reptiles love to bask in the sun to stay warm. They're special because they lay eggs, and they live all around the world. You can find them in deserts, forests, and even in the water. Amphibians Amphibians are incredible creatures. They're known for their smooth, moist skin. Amphibians can live both in the water and on land. They love to hop around and swim in ponds and streams. Frogs and toads are some of our favorite amphibians. They start their lives as tadpoles and grow into big frogs. Amphibians make fun sounds too, like <laughs> Axolotl Fish Fish are amazing creatures with a wide variety of shapes and colors. They live in oceans and freshwater rivers and lakes. What's most interesting is how they breathe. Fish have gills that allow them to extract oxygen from water, which means they can stay underwater. These incredible animals have specialized adaptations. Some of them glow in the dark ocean depths, while others have special mouths for feeding. Their diversity is what makes them so fascinating and fun to explore. So, the next time you see a fish, remember just how incredible and unique they are in their underwater world. Let's talk about invertebrates. Invertebrates are animals that don't have a backbone. They are incredibly diverse and can be found in all shapes and sizes. Arthropods. Arthropods are a group of special creatures that have a lot of legs and like to wear their skeleton on the outside, just like a suit of armor. Some of the most famous arthropods are bees, butterflies, ants, spiders, crabs, and centipedes. Mollusks Mollusks are animals that come in all shapes and sizes. And many of them live in the water, just like snails. Snails are like tiny houses with a twist. They carry their homes on their backs. They move really slowly and love munching on yummy leaves. Octopuses. Octopuses are the ocean's acrobats. They have eight arms and can change colors to hide from other animals. They're super smart. Oysters. Oysters are like chefs that make pearls. They have shells that can be very bumpy on the outside. Inside, they create pearls that can be very shiny. 
annelids. Annelids are wiggly, segmented worms, and they come in different shapes and sizes. Some live in the soil and help plants grow, while others live in the ocean and have colorful bristles on their bodies. Echinoderms Echinoderms are ocean superheroes with spiky skin. Sea stars have arms and come in bright colors. Sea urchins are round and covered in spikes. While sea cucumbers help clean the ocean, they're all part of the fantastic underwater world. Sponges Sponges are ocean filters with tiny holes. They're soft and squishy, providing homes for small fish. Sponges have been around for a very long time, like ancient underwater survivors. My bad. Cnidarians. Cnidarians are ocean creatures with beautiful shapes. They have stinging tentacles to catch food and protect themselves. Some build coral reefs, which are underwater homes for many animals. Let's do a quick test to find out if you've learned some things about vertebrate and invertebrate animals. Is this animal vertebrate or invertebrate? You're right, a cow is a vertebrate animal. Is this animal vertebrate or invertebrate? You're right, this very hungry caterpillar is an invertebrate animal. Which animal is a vertebrate? Correct answer, a donkey is a vertebrate animal. Which animal is an invertebrate? Right answer, a butterfly is an invertebrate animal. Thank you for joining us on this exciting adventure. Into the world of vertebrate and invertebrate animals, continue exploring, asking questions, and learning about the amazing creatures that share our planet.